Rain by Manya Stojic. It was hot. Everything was hot and dry. The red soil was hot and dry and cracked. A porcupine sniffed around. It's time, she whispered. The rain is coming. I can smell it. I must tell the zebras. Lightning flashed. The rain is coming, said the zebras. Porcupine can smell it. We can see it. We must tell the baboons. Thunder boom. The rain is coming, cried the baboons. Porcupine can smell it. The zebras can see it. We can hear it. We must tell the rhino. A raindrop splashed. The rain is here, said the rhino. Porcupine smelled it. The zebras saw it. The baboons heard it. And I felt it. I must tell the lion. The lion spoke in a deep purr. Yes, the rain is here. I can smell it. I can see it. I can hear it. I can feel it. And... He sighed. I can taste it. It rained and it rained and it rained. It rained until every river gushed and gurgled. It rained until every waterhole was full. Then the rain stopped and everywhere long feathery grasses grew from the soil. Every tree began to sprout fresh green leaves. I can't taste the rain now, heard the lion. But I can enjoy the shade of these big green leaves. I can't feel the rain now, said the rhino. But I can lie in the cool, soft, squelchy mud. We can't hear the rain now, shouted the baboons. But we can eat fresh, juicy fruit from the trees. We can't see the rain now said the zebras, but we can have a refreshing drink from the water hole. I can't smell the rain now, whispered the porcupine, but I know that it will come back again when it's time. The sun shone over the plain. It was hot. Everything was drying out. The red soil was hot and dry. A tiny crack appeared. 